Macomb County has a lot of new businesses coming into the M59 corridor with even more in the discussion stages. One key developer sees Hall Road becoming like a Michigan Avenue in Chicago, a destination for the entire family where there's everything from entertainment to auto repair. Mara McDonald is live in Sterling Heights tonight. Mara, a new uh, wholesale club is under construction I'm hearing too right now. Already, Kimberly, it's called BJ's Wholesale. It's an outfit out of the West Coast, and when it comes here, it's bringing 140 new jobs. But that's not all. There is more retail planned here, as well as other projects in the planning stages. The amount of traffic that rolls through the M59 corridor is vast, and it's not all from Macomb or even Michigan. Its proximity to Sarnia means on any given day, you see many Canadian plates. It's the big city thing, you know, it's uh, like the Michigan Avenue for Chicago. Uh, it's where people from smaller towns will drive in because there's nothing like what Hall Road has in the smaller community. And they don't just come for the retail, but for the dining and entertainment. Expect to see more entertainment coming in. We like Top Golf a lot. We think it's a great brand. That'll be excellent. We like Mary Andretti's concept with uh, karting and uh, virtual reality and bowling alley uh, all rolled into one. And we keep getting approached by other ones. With options for families. I chose to live out here to raise my kids in a good area and to send them to, you know, great schools. Um, and it really is tough to find something besides a Chuck E. Cheese. What we heard from shoppers is they want more clothing options. I work in downtown Detroit and there's boutiques everywhere. You know what I mean? It's fast, they got nice stuff at a reasonable price. There's none around here. At decent price points where that are specialty like Cabela's. No shock to Costello, the customer here has money, he says, but is also looking for value. One of the reasons why Wholesale Club BJ's is already under construction. Back here live, you can see the construction going up right now near 94 and 59. Expect to see that one open probably April of next year with more to come along this stretch. We're live in Sterling Heights tonight. I'm Mara McDonald local four.